How did you evolve this type of chanting that you do? How did it come about? Uh, the are you talking about the history or the chanting or? <clears throat> Chanting that you do, the one that you just demonstrated. <clears throat> um, how did it evolve? Did, is it your special type of chanting or? Actually, actually, uh, there are many monasteries, and each monastery has their their own way <coughs> or their own style. And our monastery, I think, one of the reasons was that was one of the largest ones. So, of course, in earlier, uh, there were no. Uh, a sound system. So, with this chanting style, you can make it a bit more powerful than your regular sound. So, I think that's one of the reasons that the monastery used this, adopted this style. But originally, it says that from a great master from India who created this sound and mainly <clears throat> to create the sound that is uh, kind of coming from a deep your throat or your stomach with the kind of creating vibration and <clears throat> to bring it very low and one hand I think that's helpful for uh, releasing one's stress and calming down oneself and also helpful for the concentration of your mind so when we chant this the first step is to create the vibrating sound from your vocal cord so kind of vibrating it and then then you later on making it's like O sound ooh, right and then a kind of om sound and then you try to make a, a pronunciation or this uh, read this read or say the word so that's how we practice it <laughs>